As a father, I've only ever wanted the best for Elizabeth. Therefore, three years or so ago, when Adam approached me to reassure me that he would look after my daughter forever, I was pleased beyond words and very grateful. When I see Elizabeth and Adam together, it's obvious to me and everyone who knows them both that they are deeply in love and at six or so years together they've achieved so much. To my wonderful almost wife, where do I begin? I cannot believe it is finally our wedding day. I hope Frankie is behaving herself and give her a big kiss from me. I can't wait to see her. After 1,905 days officially going out, much flirting, so, so many amazing adventures, endless laughter, it is finally the day we call ourselves husband and wife. It has all led up to today, celebrating our love, our journey, and moving into a new chapter, and I cannot wait for what is to come next. From the moment I met you, I knew we had something special. So special, I want to commit the rest of my life to you. We are the perfect male and female of the same person and I genuinely could not live without you. I'll be thinking of you at every moment this morning and I cannot wait to see you down that aisle in your stunning dress. Let's do this. See you soon, your soon husband. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. As a sign of our marriage. As a sign of our marriage. With my body I honor you. With my body I honor you. All that I am I give to you. All that I am I give to you. All that I have I share with you. All that I have I share with you. Within the love of God. Within the love of God. Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. I therefore proclaim that they are husband and wife. Those whom God has joined together, let no one put asunder. When deciding to go ahead with our COVID wedding, you realise the importance of the basics, and that is love. Love has really got us through this year, and after postponing the first time, they're coming so close to the second. Uh, all we wanted to be was husband and wife, and today we can finally say, Mr. and Mrs. Green. Liz, from day one you've been very special. We have been together for over six years and I still ask myself every day how I deserve someone as amazing as you. You are so thoughtful, generous, loving and the most kind-hearted person I've ever met. I'm so proud of you. You are my best friend and soulmate and I love you forever. Our wish came true when we had little Frankie. She is so special and warms our hearts and it's really got us through this year. 
Liz, I'm so lucky to have you. There's no other person on the planet I'd rather be with. I look forward to growing old with you, adventuring, making more memories, laughing and loving every day. Raise your glasses to my new beautiful wife, Elizabeth Green. beautiful lizards and what a lucky man Adam is. I want to talk from my heart on the perfect relationship we have been privileged to watch today. I still remember the days when Adam first met Liz at college and couldn't stop talking about her and I'll be frank the situation still hasn't changed. <laughs> Saying that he was head over heels is an understatement he was absolutely besotted. It didn't take me long whatsoever that you'd not only met your forever person but also your best friend. I have watched over time you both grow so much as people. Your relationship has not only gotten stronger every time I see you, but any obstacles life throws at you, you, you overcome. You both strive to make each other better and better and stronger and stronger, which is the true definition of what a good relationship is. You have built your own business together, you have built a home, and you have now built a family with Dougie, Pepper, <laughs> and a beautiful daughter, Franks. And now, this is the next exciting chapter of your life as husband and wife, I'm sure you will all join me in wishing Adam and Liz Green all the best and wishing them a long and very happy married life forever. Yeah.